sometimes I'm just crazy. But I think with I mean it's not that far, I mean I keep saying I mean. I gotta stop that. It's not cool. Okay, so it's you always just see me randomly clicking. So I might have to just cut this part out. Hopefully it's not something important. I don't start spurting out anything any anything important. So what should I go for? Should I go for the faceless the druids? Well, I, I could read them, what the fuck was I thinking? Let's read this one out, right? The wise druids of old were disciplined group of people from all races who tried to maintain world balance with mystical discipline and powerful magic. Affiliating yourself with the druid faction will boost your magic capabilities and reward balancing of all things. So the magical capabilities, so the mana related stuff. What about this one? Little is known about the faceless, and but it is said that they did not possess indiv individual minds. In instead, they were connect all connected to a central consciousness, which governed all their choices and behaviors. Affiliating yourself with the faceless faction will boost your production based on your past choices, while giving progressively better bonuses. Ah. Uh. Okay, so we'll go with uh, we'll go with faceless, right? It sounds cool, and it seems to just uh, have that positive feedback that like you get something, and what you're going to do next becomes easier, right? So I'm just here clicking again, and you can forward if it gets a little bit boring. Uh, you can just skip. I'll skip the vid or something. No, don't. I don't know. Don't skip the vid. You can just skip time around it. Like skip on to the next minute or so, like that. And you, you would be like, you would get what you want. If something is boring, you don't need to just stay over there. But sometimes, you know, when you're narrating, you don't immediately like. You're not hundred percent, hundred percent sure that you're gonna come up with something funny. I don't think I even come up with something funny. It's just me literally doing some less plays on some idle games. It's really narrating sometimes about the things I do. I don't do so much. Well, like, like that. Like I literally speak something random. So maybe for 500, I need 500 fairy and 500 undead. Okay, 500 fairy and 500 undead. Oh, 167. But that's wow, well, that's for 20 seconds. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. So find fairy and find her undead. Hey, it's Hall of Legends. Sweet. So is this this is what? Mm. We have only collected 2,000 this time. Okay, one has reached 500. But I don't know if this is the faction that I want. I literally don't know what this got. I think it's fairy. Isn't that, isn't that the symbol of a fairy? I can't really tell that. But we'll get this soon. I mean, there's not much left there. What's this? 149SX. And that's not a lot. And then. Hey, I got something like what's this? Increase purchase by it doesn't do so much. Oh, this would do a lot. Yes, it does a lot. Come on, why don't you still let me purchase it? Fairy now, yes, so now we're gonna purchase it. This is the time we've been waiting for. All right, what is this? What's well, just the thing that will be purchased up? Okay, let's see what's this. You have a chance to have a labyrinth built for free. Where the hell is it? Each time you click for money. This chance is based on your income per second at the cost of next labyrinth. Okay. What the hell is that? Oh, it's this one. Interesting. Labyrinth production is also increased by 5,000. The school for each assistant you own. 
what the fuck is this? I just want to see how much my, you know, income is going to go. So it tripled. What's this one? Increase faction coin fine chance based on the amount of labyrinths you own. So it literally doubles our chance of finding faction coins. Sweet. What's this one? Increase the production of all buildings based on the time spent on your longest game session. Oh, I'm happy I've been offline for six days. Because I think it's all adding up now. It's work, working towards now. Sweet. I don't need this. I just need labyrinth. And there was something that said here something. What's that? Give a chance to have a labyrinth built for free each time you click. Let's see if I get something. Oh. So are you serious? All I need to do is just click and I get like labyrinths built for free. I mean that's, that's just crazy cool. Now I can just be offline and get the boost I want. Okay this is asking for SP so that uh, I can increase the gem bonus okay what's this increase the alchemist lab what's the legendary leaders legend among legends wait a minute what's the difference it's all about hall of legends isn't it what's this brainwave there's something new here increase the production of all buildings for accumulating two percent per second for ten minutes ah uh, should be cool I mean how, how does it work Oh, it increases by 2% like for every... Oh, I want to have something that clicks. Where's the thing? Oh, this is a chance based... This chance is based on your income per second. It's going down. It's going down actually. Every time I click... Or every time I get a labyrinth, the chance goes down. It is not cool. What is this? Increase the production of all buildings based on the amount of buildings, so and so. Okay, the production is gone. I mean, that's not much of a bonus, isn't it? I mean, it's not so much. I mean, it's... What can you say? Maybe this was the better thing to go for. This is just, this is the fucking most useless thing that I would have done. Okay, so what's this? 2500 fairy coins, 2500 coins. And it unlocks upgrades. What's this? Oh, it's something here. So, increases the production of Hollow Legends by 75%, increases the production of all of the buildings. Okay, so let's do it. Sweet. Why is this thing the only thing that's unlocked? Can't I buy some labyrinths? Seems like I can't. You have unlocked the trophy 300. I mean, I'm just gonna really go to the top of this. Mm. Because it's just literally giving me a territory expansion for free. I'm not gonna say no to that. See, that is 311. It must be a little bit annoying to just see me clicking. It's not like I have outraged income or something. But oh, you have reached also. What's this? Oh, here it is. Take a look at this, guys. Labyrinth production by 200%. So, and this is the one for here, Hall of Legends. Let's click that first. Okay, not so much. This is the thing I think is going to give us a massive boost. Yes, it literally, it well, it went, it literally went a little more than double. Right? Did we get any assistance? How do I get these guys? What's this? Increase the production of all buildings by 8%. Okay. Now, I need what? 2500 fairy and undead. Oh, I forgot I could do these things. Like, what will happen if I buy this? I want to buy one. Oh, it's asking, right? So it asks if I want. So if the other ones, it doesn't ask. Alright. So I'll buy max of the other ones. Just to get our income just a little bit higher. I should have done that in the start itself. Let's take a look at that. Something I should have attempted at the start itself. Uh, what's the gem grinder? There, give me all the Aussie. I mean, that's that's really a lot. Talk about labyrinth. Jesus Christ. 
Can I use the touchpad? Yeah. It suddenly got suddenly froze for a second there. Hey, it's not going. Usually when I do this, it gives me that oh, there it comes again. I just thought it was fine for a few seconds, but it gave me that right click. I hate that. Okay, what about now? It's zero percent. Jesus. So now what? We need this one to really see where it goes next. So we need like 900 more, 1100 more. So I'm gonna just continuously keep on going with this. I'll just make cuts in the widths here and there because I want. I'm just so interested to see the this thing out thoroughly, like in one go.